Virgos and Scorpios, that is one of the easier combinations, better combinations. But I always advise you, if you want to see how uh, another person impacts you and why they're in your life, compare your ascendant to their sun or moon sign, or also their ascendant. Uh, and if you want to see how you will impact another person, what is your meaning in their life? Why are you there in your life? What are you going to bring into their life that they'll learn from you? Compare their ascendant sign to your sun or moon or the ascendant to a lesser degree. Uh, but let's see how it works. For instance, your ascendant is in Virgo to a lesser degree, sun or moon is in Virgo and a Scorpio appears in your life. And the Scorpio person say their sun or their moon is in Scorpio will trigger your third house. And astrologically speaking, third house is a house of siblings and uh, you often the Scorpio people that comes into the life of the Virgo person, especially Virgo ascendant person, the Virgo person will almost feel like brother feelings towards them, brother sister feelings. Even in romantic relationships, they'll have a great friendships between them. Uh, they can have much more easy flow of energy between them because third house is such kind of a friendship type of uh, sibling relationships that it triggers. Also, third house is a house of curiosity, of adventure, of expanding one's mind. So Scorpio can really help a Virgo person uh, become even more interested about life, become more curious, become more Peter Pan-like, child-like, uh, become more adventurous. So Virgo and Scorpios can go on adventures together, even if, even if you're kind of a Scorpio, which is very, uh, sorry, if you're a Virgo person, ascendant or sun or moon, who is very traditional, very down to earth, who doesn't like doing crazy things, a Scorpio person can come into your life and you might all of a sudden have a desire to do new things you've never tried before, like learn to swim or learn to speak a language or learn to uh, scuba dive or canoe or something more adventurous that you usually would not have the courage to do. Scorpio can bring also more courage and initiative into the life of a Virgo, especially Virgo ascendant person and can help them become, um, have more self-starting energy, self-initiative, because third house rules all those activities. Third house in astrology is called uh, the difficult house because it's where we learn to do difficult things, but usually where we learn to do practical skills. And often people feel quite daunted to learn to use a computer, or to learn to knit, or to learn a new language, or to learn to play an instrument, or to learn to play a game, you know. Uh, uh, but the Scorpio will trigger those qualities. A Scorpio person, sun or moon, will help you feel less scared about them, will help you become more curious about those things as well, you know, and learn new information. A Scorpio can be a great source of interesting new information for you, almost like a journalist, like someone who love to, you love to gossip with and exchange information, and someone who always brings you new, interesting, exciting things to share with you, because third house rules the lower mind, and everything that the lower mind is interested in is like the surrounding environment, what's happening to the world, magazines, news, you know, and a Scorpio can trigger this interest in you into those things, those new things of learning and, you know, uh, learning and, and, and knowledge, you know, and skill. And also third house um, hmm, rules communication. So often the Scorpio can help the Leo, can help uh, the Virgo person have better express themselves, or have better communication, teach them how to maybe speak or how to, uh, you know, express their opinions. And often a Scorpio person, uh, a Virgo person will find Scorpio people more interesting, more intelligent, more fun. Third house also rules games and plays and, you know, playing games together. So that's why it's great for friendship. Even if it's a lover, lover, lover relationship, you'll be playful and, you know, stimulate easy, enjoyable things to each other and interesting things uh, are like games and fun, and, you know, communication, exchanging information. What if you're a Scorpio ascendant or to a lesser degree sun or moon? Then a Virgo person, moon or sun, will trigger your 11th house for the Scorpio. So the Virgo person, 11th house is a house of friendships. So it's very similar to third house, but on a higher level. So a Scorpio person can really benefit from Virgo person. Uh, through uh, Virgo person can bring to the Scorpio new expanded uh, field of friendships, new expanded uh, network of friends, can uh, bring, um, uh, can introduce the Virgo person to benefactors who can help the Virgo person late, later in life for achieving their goals and dreams. The Scorpio, uh, the Scor sorry, 
the Virgo person can help the Scorpio person, introduce the Scorpio person to such benefactors, or the Virgo person can themselves be such a benefactor, which helps the Scorpio person fulfill some of their goals and dreams, which is the 11th house, can help them further their, uh, their progress into the achieving of those goals and dreams by giving them some ideas, by introducing them to the right people, by giving them any information which will help them in that way. Also, a Virgo person will tend to be more gainful for the Scorpio person because the 11th house rules gains financial or uh, you know, interests or, uh, or connections, gains through other connections. So, uh, you know, a Virgo person will benefit from a Scorpio person. If you worried whether to go into a relationship, business relationship with a Scorpio person, sorry, if you're a Virgo, if you're a Scorpio and you're worried whether to go into a relationship with a if you're Scorpio and you're worried whether to go into a relationship with a Virgo person, don't worry because go for it because the Virgo person triggers your 11th house of gains so they will bring you some beneficial influence to your life but often Scorpio and Virgos can be very good friends, can help each other expand their mind, can help each other progress their goals and dreams, can um, introduce each other to bigger circles, can bring new knowledge to each other so it's quite stimulating and positive influence between the two signs uh, uh, and of course there can be other blocking influences but this is what a Virgo person will be into the life of a Scorpio to expand their networks of people, to expand their, uh, to expand their, uh, <laughs> to expand their, sorry, uh, to ex well, uh, yeah, I think you got me. I'm not going to repeat myself anymore. That's about it. Thank you.